A sisterhood of intense athletes have made roller derby the fastest growing sport in America. These derby girls say that the sport fuels their passions and enriches their lives. I feel like when I go out and compete with these strong athletic women, I'm I'm there and I can actually compete with them and I can I can be powerful against them. Though it began as a joke sport in the 1930s, today's roller derby is a hard-hitting game played by a growing sisterhood of serious athletes. Derby is the only sport where you can go see an all-female sport, full contact, fully physical, fast, hard-hitting, aggressive sport that's all women. Doherty is relying on the sport's appeal to women to market a preteen book about a young derby girl's dreams and adventures. This is a tween book for, a book for tweens, called Dorothy's Derby Chronicles, Adventures of Girls Who Like to Hit the Track. And all the lessons that derby teaches, I just thought it seemed, it seemed like a perfect fit for girls. Derby girls play under colorful monikers that match their personalities and humor. The names are earned after months of work and hard practice on the track. Doherty goes by the name Undertaker's Daughter. My dad was an undertaker, so growing up, I, you know, we used to work at the funeral home, we used to clean the cars, and then in high school I used to pick up bodies for money. Today's derby girl is a wheeled athlete who holds down a job, buys her own health insurance, and competes with passion. I'm a patrol officer. I patrol the streets, take reports, do traffic stuff, do um, kind of preventative measures to prevent crime. The roller derby is a great outlet for just physical activity, but also for aggression. Kind of, you get kind of mad about things and it kind of builds up. So being able to go out in a legal way that's sanctioned and everybody's there because they want to do the same thing and hit each other and it's kind of a fun stress relief. Roller derby is for serious athletes in search of a full contact sport that enriches their lives. And it empowers women who are on the team to be strong, to be independent, to have a voice, to fight for what they believe in, to be part of a team. It's very unique because women don't usually get the opportunity to be so aggressive and strong in their lives. We don't have um, a way for women to be sexy and aggressive and strong. Modern Derby is no joke. The women who play are part of a dedicated sisterhood that treats the game with respect. It has evolved since 2001, not very long ago, into very much a sport where um, there are regional competitions, national competitions, and people are training very hard and really taking it seriously as a sport. But it is also a business run by the players who act as their own coaches and trainers. For Angela Gordon, derby is more than a game. I feel like it helps me in my daily life because I feel like maybe the challenges that I face in life aren't as hard as me having to <laughs> jam against these huge athletic women. Roller derby has spread to nearly every community in America. And as the sisterhood grows, the sport will become more popular and more important to modern women. You just see all these women from just completely different backgrounds coming together and being part of something that's really empowering and special. One of the benefits of joining roller derby for young women, for any woman, is the camaraderie, the sisterhood that you get from being in a group of women who are very strong women, very athletic. It's just like a sisterhood, you know, and you can, you, you can be with other women who are like your family.